Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum friends. I am Abdul Mutin Yunus representing mastery.com. Today we are going to discuss another interesting topic with you that is what are the units that we use in memory to store data that is memory units. Before starting our video I request my new viewers kindly subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so that they can get my new uploaded videos easily. Now moving towards our topic that is memory units. Memory unit is the amount of data that can be stored in the storage unit. This storage capacity is expressed in the terms of bytes. This is the simple definition of memory unit. Now we will see what are the main memory storage units are used in a daily life. The first one is bit that is binary digit then nibble, byte and word. First we will discuss what is bit. A binary digit is logical 0 and 1 representing a passive or an active state of a component in an electric circuit. Then nibble. A group of 4 bits is called a nibble. And then byte. A group of 8 bits is called byte. A byte is the smallest unit which can represent a data item or a character. And then word. A computer word like a byte is a group of fixed number of bits processed as a unit which varies from computer to computer but is fixed for each computer. The length of a computer word is called word size or word length. It may be as small as 8 bits or may be as long as 96 bits. A computer stores the information in the form of computer words. And then we will see there are some higher storage units that we use in our daily life. First is kilobyte, then megabyte, then gigabyte, then terabyte and petabyte. First kilobyte, that is called KB. One kilobyte is equal to 1024 bytes. And then megabyte, that is MB. One MB or megabyte is equal to 1024 kilobyte. Then gigabyte, GB. One gigabyte is equal to 1024 megabyte then terabyte tb 1 terabyte is equal to 1024 gigabyte and then the last petabyte that is pb 1 petabyte is equal to 1024 terabyte so friend at the last a number of memory units are shown and you can also see that the highest memory unit measurement is gigabyte so friends this is are some important storage units that I have discussed with you. I hope you will understand it. If you have any query or you want to give us any suggestion, then kindly comment us below. Inshallah, we will meet you in the next lecture with a new topic. That's it. Khuda Hafiz.